Today we are going to learn about acknowledgement choreography and now this is very very important if you need to understand this you need to understand the previous video which I have made regarding the types of acknowledgements the original mode and an answered mode so you should always cover this video before coming to this particular part and we'll learn what is acknowledgement choreography it is nothing but how the acknowledgement which is sent back has been decided for example I said when a message is sent from sending application to receiving application there is an acknowledgement received back to the sending application in that there are two types of acknowledgement original mode and enhanced mode original is nothing but a simple acknowledgement and answer is nothing but a detailed acknowledgement so how the receiving application over here will decide to send the original acknowledgement or an answered mode acknowledgement that will cover this particular topic so over here you can see when msh 15 and 16 are blank the receiving application will send the original mode acknowledgement so it is not going to send so that's the section over here but when it should send an answered mode application it should have a value over here in the msh 15 it should be valued okay so this part tells how uh, the receiving application will differentiate between original mode and the unanswered mode over here okay so now uh, the session is not over yet we need to see a lot of examples and how things work over here and what are the other values even the other values will define other things for example in MSS 16 anyhow in original mode both are blank we are not bothering about original mode right now we are bothering about what is WPP and what is ACK so we will get an immediate ACK when MSH 15 is valued okay just remember when MSH 15 is valued for an answered mode don't focus on original mode over here now the topic is over over here and here we'll see when it is valued we'll get immediate ACK now what about MSH 16 when it is value we will get WPP WPP is nothing but rapid text so uh, again we need to learn about WPP and WPPR before understanding what is the type of acknowledgements as I said the topic will go more deeper and deeper and deeper in each and every context here so you might uh, get confused so please focus on each and every part or try to write the notes so WPR stands for rapid application data and WPP over here stands for rapid application response both are different we are going to discuss about what is uh, WPR and I'll test type over here WPR also for our understanding purpose it's not in the table but yeah I'll just uh, help you out on that particular part okay as of now yep ignore this particular WPR and PP uh, this is how it has been decided for example I'll show an example of MSH 15 valued so this is one small example over here you can say MS 15 and you can see the values never and always so these are the values which will decide so over here you can see there are like two values it's not blank so MS 15 and 16 have some values means this part valued valued I'll again go back it is valued for example I remove something over here MS 15 has a value MS 16 is blank means this part MS 15 is a value and it is blank if I do this means this part 16 as a value and blank it will get WPP if I remove both values over here 15 and 16 it will get original mode acknowledgement okay you should remember that that's how the acknowledgement choreography is done that's an interesting way to name this particular topic as choreography means this particular two fields are deciding everything how the response should be and what it should be that's the reason they named it as choreography as I initially said each and every MSH field is very 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 important so we're discussing about MSH 15 over here and lot of nodes and how it has been used different type of errors so everything is important generally we focus on like sending application receiving application but uh, as I said uh, starting uh, MSH 1 to 20 lo lot of other fields every field has a reason and that's the reason I have been explaining each and everything even I felt boring while I while explaining MSS 19, PID 3, PID 5, 6, 7, which each and every field is very, very important to learning further, uh, even for certification. Now, again, the subtopic here is like, what is the value? 
okay we we were valuing it right so what can be those values okay what can be those values so i'll be covering those particular values in the next session what are those values and what type of response we are going to receive it thank you